just started broadcasting just now. It's posting. And all of you guys that are on the webinar, we are doing what's called a Google Hangout. And this is the first time that we are doing this. Uh, pretty exciting. So you guys, and this is the first time that we are doing this. Ira. All right, so some technical difficulties. Anybody playing the video somewhere? I don't think they're playing it. That's what happened to me earlier. Somebody needs to close a window. It's an extra window open. They got to open and two people. Somebody needs to close a window. It's an extra window we are flying without a net. All right. We are flying without a net. Where is that coming from? All right. We are flying without a net. Oh, there we go. Okay, that was my bad. <laughs> okay. Um, all right. I think we are good. I think we're good. So. All right, we figured that one out because we are live broadcasting. I had the stream open and it was playing as we were doing that. So first Google Hangout. Um, let me give you guys the link again. It's um, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna say what it is because I don't I can't read off all that. But I'm giving you the link. Uh, go ahead and uh, get on uh, that Google Hangout. That's where we are live right there, and you can see us on the. Um, and we've got Ashley joining in over here. Good. Hey. Hi, Ashley. All right. So we're going to get started here in just a little bit. But um, what I want you guys to do is make sure you're on the Google Hangout. I will keep a – I'm going to keep something up there, that, you know, that says get on the um, get on the Hangout so you guys can see that. But we're going to talk about – I want to introduce Mary, who's done some phenomenal stuff. Um, in her life, as and uh, hold on one second, get on here. Well, actually, here here's where it is. It's um, it's mojovideo.org/hangout. That will also give you get you to the right place. It's mojovideo.org/hangout. Okay, and got it. You are talking over yourself. Okay. Yeah. So what you want to do is, if you're if you're actually on, um, if you're on the Google Hangout, I would X out of the webinar. Okay. I would definitely X out of the webinar, and I would uh, I would make sure that. Um, so here's what I'm going to do. Okay. Got it. I mute you. You're not muted, bro. It's showing up muted on my thing. Okay. All right. So here's how this goes. Um, what you need to do is close down your audio on either the GoToWebinar or um, mute the YouTube on the live stream or. Um, Mute the YouTube on the live stream. Corey, we got that problem again. Corey, we got that problem again. Okay. Okay. All right, we're gonna fix this. We'll fi we'll figure this out. Hold on one second. Um, how do you type in questions on YouTube? Yeah, you would just go to. Um, you got to have a have it open. Questions on YouTube. Yeah, you would just go to. Um, you got to have a have it open. Can you guys make sure you have all the windows closed down besides the Hangout, so that way we don't have any feedback? Everybody, you know, if you're doing the Google Hangout with us. So we're just learning this, and we're actually going to be talking to you guys and teaching you guys how to use this to prospect and how to actually do sales calls with this. Um, we'll just do chat on here, but close down one either you know close down either the go to meeting, and I'm I'm actually going to just close down the audio on go to meeting here in a second. I'm going to leave the uh, everything up for you guys to see as far as the just where to go. Okay. So I'm going to leave this up on the go to meeting. 
and that's where we're going to be at. Okay. All right, and I'll do this one more time in the chat box. So just figuring things out. Right. Let's see. Video.org slash hangout. Send to all. So it's mojovideo.org slash hangout. Mojovideo.org slash hangout. We'll get the hang of it here in a second. So, um, and if you're not talking, if you're in our hangout and you're not talking and, and you got some other sounds coming in, make sure you mute yourself. And we will do, you can just chat in the GoToMeeting, but make sure you close down either your the audio here. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to actually go mute here and I'm going to mute it on go to meeting but I'm going to be live in the hangout so make sure you go there now I want to make sure you can see that and then we're just going to get kick started here for everybody that's on okay so now we're just live on the you can use go to meeting actually to uh, use go to meeting for the chat and use the live stream or the YouTube link for that, so we're going to do that. Okay, good. Um, okay, back to the hangout. I'm going to unmute. Uh, unmute you, Ira. Ira, are you there? Try it again. No. How about now? Okay, there we go. Good. All right, we're ready to rock and roll, and. Uh, make sure you know we're also gonna you can also go to our Facebook channel in order to interact with us that's uh, mojo that's facebook.com slash mojo video and what we're gonna do tonight is we're gonna talk about some fabulous things in fact Mary uh, sent me a bio earlier and I'm trying to find that um, because she had some really great stuff Mary can you send that bio to me again um, that would Okay, perfect. Uh, because she's done some fabulous stuff in the local internet marketing world. In fact, Mary just signed up as a reseller, and she is uh, there. We go, good. And uh, she saw the power in video. She herself does mobile marketing, and uh, she does that very well. And she, in fact, she's taught lots of people to do mobile marketing. And she herself, um, and and. And she's going to tell us a little bit about how she got started, some of the challenges that she was facing, all of that. And um, and hold on, let me let me bring this up. Uh, let's see the about tab. Okay, cool. I'm just about I'm just about tempted to ask you if you hit the record button. <laughs> I, you know what? I am recording. It's okay. recording. <laughs> well, the good thing so the good thing about Google Hangouts is that it records for you. Which is awesome. Ah. Yep. Absolutely. So I don't have to worry about that. Um, That's good. You know, right. So so I we're, when you broadcast on Google Hangout and you go live, there's two things. You can when you go live, it's always recording. If you're doing it from a, just a Hangout and you're not live on air, then it doesn't record it. So that's one of the things about Google Hangouts. Now we're going to be talking about later is how you can use Google Hangouts to actually prospect and actually how to close deals because we were actually live on a sales call with one of uh, Mary's great friends uh, earlier which is fabulous and we're going to talk more about that but let me kind of introduce Mary you know Mary is an internet and mobile marketing business specialist, specialist and she is known as the mobile marketing queen she has taught small business about SEO and how to attract better customers with mobile marketing devices and she's an internet marketer. You know, she's an ebook creator. She's a newsletter author. She's a website designer, affiliate marketer, and mentor. She's run a successful internet and offline business, and several successful online websites. And here's here's what's cool about Mary: she's used her passion for networking to help 185 small businesses to start building their web and mobile presence from offline to online. And all the way to mobile marketing in less than 30 days. Less than 30 days. That's that's insane. Wow. So she convinced 185 small business owners to take the critical steps steps to marketing their business in only three weeks. Exciting stuff. And that's what earned her the title of mobile marketing queen. She's a master networker. Uh, her secret sauce is that she's dedicated 
motivated, she's determined, and she's tenacious. And, and some of the things that you really need to be in this arena in order to really crush it. And she's got a really un unique approach about identifying passions that translate into almost immediate profits quickly and easily. And she has taught the course how to become a mobile marketing consultant and re she reveals her little known secrets. And so she's pretty much ahead of the curve and we're glad to have her on here. We were connected through one of our dear partners, Gina Gaudio Graves, and are excited to introduce uh, Mary Wilhite. Well, thank you for being on this show. You're welcome, welcome, Mary. Thank you. Thank you so much. Yeah, and we're excited. We're excited about the things that you're going to share here today. And uh, now there's a, a couple things. Gina said something interesting. You were actually a, a professional cheerleader at one point. Is that true? Yes, for the Chicago Bears. Right wow. on. That's excellent. <laughs> wow. And, and so anyway, it, as we go along, if you got something to say, just kind of pipe up, and um, you know, these we're getting used to these hangouts, but that's that's fabulous. Sorry, I did want to say this. It was back in a day when Walter Payton was there. For those oh. out there who uh, who are old enough to know who <laughs> Walter Payton was, uh, he was a running back, and yeah. uh, he had just came into the league. Wow. When I was cheering for the Chicago Bears. So I don't want to say which years. You guys can look that up, but. <laughs> it was some time ago, but it was it was probably one of the highlights of my life. Just really having a great time, learning uh, so much about the world, and learning just about people and stuff. So being a cheerleader for the Chicago Bears was definitely definitely a great experience. Well, Mary, you must have some amazing Mike Ditka stories that we can talk about later. <laughs> oh yeah, definitely, definitely, no doubt. He was. Uh, I don't want to get into all the trash. But if you guys, like, <laughs> you know, I'll tell you, I'll give you guys some of it. But, oh, I'm uh, sure, yeah. <laughs> but, um, oh, that's yeah, great. So let's get right into it because this is, you've got some exciting stuff here because, you know, Mary, tell us a little bit about where you came from and, and, uh, and all that stuff. You know, how did you get into local marketing? What got you started? What was that thing that said, I need to do this? And uh, so, so tell us a little bit about that. Well, um, really, I was a career politician. And uh, I helped uh, politi politicians really get elected. And then I decided I wanted to do it myself. So I ran three times, 04, 06, and 08. And one of those times, I lost by 35 votes. But the last time when I ran in 08, I just got fed up. And I just wanted something different in my life and went to a internet marketing event and just got bit by a bug and been there ever since. And that led to the internet marketing space was kind of crowded and it still is. And that just led to mobile marketing. I found out about mobile marketing in 08, 09 and just threw my heart and soul into it and did everything I could to learn everything I could as fast as I could and just began to um, talk to people and talk to clients about what mobile marketing was all about and a lot of which is interested in what the new new phase was what the new and I, w I don't want to say fat but just really what was new um, in terms of marketing they knew that the yellow pages wasn't working anymore and they wanted to try something different to see whether or not it could help their marketing that's awesome. Very cool. And and so tell me, um, you got into it and you got bit by the bug and and you're starting to get out there and, and uh, so tell me one of your first successes. What was that first thing that that really helped you be successful? Because like you, I mean there's a lot of people in different arenas on this call, from people that are, you know, they're they're experienced and they've got clients to people that are looking for their first clients to um, you know, people that are working on their fifth client, or they're they're working on being from getting from three thousand dollars per month all the way to ten thousand dollars per month. So there's a broad field of people, but every success really matters. And so, what were those successes for you that really kind of uh, really got you excited initially? Well, what I did was I leveraged relationships, Corey, that I already had. Um, I don't believe in reinventing the wheel. I mean, everything that I knew that I needed was already there and I may have not I may didn't know all the pieces but I knew how to talk to people and I think that was the biggest thing 
So I leverage the relationships that I already had, whether it was the pizza shop down the street or a salon or my dentist. I go to my dentist at least three times a year. And um, my doctor, I just started leveraging everything that I knew. My realtor, um, just people. I, I, I was a member of the chamber. I was a member of Lions Club. I was a member of Rotary. I mean, I was just involved. I mean, I, I just, I was immersed in in, in um, networking because of my my career. But I just, I just leveraged everything that I could. So what I did was I sat down. And that's the first thing I think uh, that that they need to do, even if it's just 25 names. Sit down and write down those 25 names or 25 businesses that you have close relation that you have a close relationship with, and just start target targeting and going after those. But I wrote down I wrote a list, and the list was probably about 400 people that I knew, um, a lot of businesses that I knew, and then I just start crossing them off. Who would buy? Uh, what I had to sell, or what I had to share, or you know whether or not I was going to give give part of it away for free and then scoop them in another way. So I just started thinking of every avenue, every angle that I could share uh, my services and products with, and I knew that um, I just had that belief in myself. I mean, we talk a lot about mindset, uh, about believing in yourself, but I had that strong belief in myself that I can do it and I just was unstoppable and I had that unstoppable urge and plus I was a hundred thousand dollars in debt from politics and I wanted to pay that hundred thousand dollars back and um, I didn't want it hanging out there for a long time because I knew interest rates could go up and so forth and so on so I just I just did it and that's that was my motivating factor and we often talk about that big why why are we doing this that was my big why get out of debt that's awesome Ira did you have something you wanted to say no I what, Mary and I spoke the other day about mindset and I think that that's really the key thing because um, we were the other night we were hearing um, I know that you know Bill Walsh or not he lives in Chicago um, Bill Walsh is, uh, you know, Power Team International. So he had an event here in Arizona, and he was talking. This was Monday evening about, uh, let's say you wanted to learn how to ski, and you read all these books on skiing, and you watched all these videos on skiing, and then they took you to the top of um, uh, Aspen, and then the hardest double black diamond uh, uh, mountain, and then they pushed you out of the helicopter, uh, but you never practiced what would happen? You'd probably get killed. And so his point was, you have to just get in there and make it happen and and lose the perfection. And we hide, be many times we hide behind, behind perfectionism and we use it as an excuse or avoidance so we don't have to get out of our comfort zone. And so, um, and so I love what you're saying here because obviously you're very fearless. I don't think you probably, if you have fear, it's very minimal and you're able to conquer it. And that's the difference between winning and losing, particularly right now in this new economy. People have to just uh, roll up their sleeves and dive in. If you're going to play water polo, you just can't have your baby toe in the pool. you got to dive in. Right, Mary? Oh, yeah. And, you know, a lot of people, I, I, I've coached a lot of folks. And I have one, and she's a dear friend now, a lady that I've coached, and she has to have everything just perfect before she moves. Yeah. She can't have it perfect. Just do it. And just get out there and jump in and do it. I mean, even if it's even even if it's not perfect, don't be a perfectionist. Um, the, it's a saying that goes, polish, um, publish, then polish. Yes. So you get out there and you 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 publish you you and pub by publishing, go to your go to the local businesses, um, give your business cards, give your brochures or flyers of what you have, follow up because the fortune is in a follow up. You'll be surprised how many people you talk to on a day to day basis of somebody that says yes, I'm interested in what you're what you're saying, what you're doing. I'm interested in your product or service, and you never call them back. Because you get busy with kids or 
you know, going to gymnastics or basketball or baseball or whatever you, right. your busy life is, and you don't follow up. You got to figure out a system and a way of how you really follow up. You know, it's funny you should talk about follow up because Corey and I actually created a software about four years ago regarding that solving that problem because when we started in business. We didn't have a database. We didn't have a client. We we um, we were starting from literally zero, so we decided we were going to go to one or two events every day, no matter what. Sometimes we'd go to three events in a day. My wife thought I was a little nuts um, because it was a little overkill, but we met all these people, and after about a month, we realized we, we had hundreds of cards, and we didn't know what to do with them. So we figured out a way to follow up and automate this with using video and having the video go to their mobile phone. So we'll talk about that later, but um, Corey and I are like evangelists regarding follow-up because, and I love when people bring up follow-up because that is the key. Um, you know, you got to touch them. The sweet spot they say is seven times. Um, uh, nothing happens, you know, on that first or second touch. You just got to build that relationship. Well, really, it was like uh, Corey and I talked to a potential prospect um, that I have um, for Mojo Video, and I've touched this guy a million times in terms of the relationships, conversations, business. So I knew when I called him about something new that he was going to be open and receptive. And not only do he have himself, but he has about 500 other people that he can bring along. And I think that's the power of getting referrals, you, using friends, uh, reciprocity, um, being able to them using you as well as things that um, you may need. But just it's a give and take type thing. So yes, the fortune is in the follow up. Yes, you do have to have the mindset. Yes, your why has to be strong. Why in a heck? Or why in the world are you doing what you're doing? Yeah. And then being able to go out there and make it happen. Right, exactly. It doesn't happen. You make them happen. Oh, yeah. And that's perfect. And that's exactly. It just doesn't happen by chance. I mean, this is something you worked hard. And so, what, so give us the story on, you know, all the people that you were able to, I mean, you, in hundreds of people that you helped bring on board as clients in the span of a, a 30 days. <laughs> Thanks, Ashley. And that is awesome. That is incredible. I have never heard of results like that. Uh, and so tell us, I mean, how did you make that happen? What was the formula? Well, the formula was the, the relationships that I built. And remember when I said I was in politics for quite some time, right? And I ran for office in 04, 08, and 04, 06, and 08. I had a bit of an advantage there, I must say. But we all have an advantage. We all know people, so I'm not going to use that as an excuse or a um, dis, dis excuse or, or not an excuse or whatever. But what I do want to say is those folks that I had met along the way um, had supported me in one way or another, whether they gave me money through fundraising. Um, when you run for office, you have to raise money in order to pay for whether it's signs, posters, T-shirts, whatever that I had made a lot of relationships. And what I did was I went back and um, began to leverage a lot of those relationships that um, I had met. And I just said, hey, look, I'm involved in this new business, and I'm excited about it, and I want to come by and tell you about it. And they were just open and receptive. And I, the, the excitement and enthusiasm, it rubs off. I mean, it just it spreads like wildfire. And then I got a lot of referrals. So if I did one, they may have referred me to their friend. So really, that's that's how I did it, and that's how I did it in such a short period of time. I just got out there and made it happen. That's and it was perfect. interesting that it was like a few happened in a few days, then a few more, and then it just kind of just blew up and went crazy. That's awesome. So, so give me kind of, um, when you're going out there and you're prospecting, you're trying to find new clients, and you've taught by now tons of local marketing consultants how to do this. What what is what is the punch list? I mean, how do you you know what's the first steps? What's the best ways? You know, for most people that are just getting started, what is the checklist that they should follow for getting their first client 
in 30 days. I mean, you got in 30 days hundreds of clients, which is amazing. So some of the some, everybody wants to get you know if they can get that one first client, they can go get the two and and then five and then from then on get way more. So what would you recommend? What are your steps to like 30 days to a sale? Your first sale. What's kind of the the ranking order of of how you would what you would suggest to somebody just getting started to, to get out there and make sales happen quickly? Well, if it's a business that they know, um, the first thing I would do is what I call mock it up. Or um, when I say mock it up, do a mock of what that business is. Do a replicate of what you're trying to sell to that business. If it's video, maybe take your camera and just, just do some funny kind of videos and go back and show them, give them some ideas, show them what they could have, show them what they're missing, and give them a reason to buy into your product. Um, for me, um, now it's mobile apps. So what I do is I create an app of that business, and I just go in and show it to them. And when I show it to them, that gets them excited. So for us and this particular product, and for Bert, I just, for the guy that we talked to earlier, I just have to look at his business, take a take a good look at it, whether I look at his website, um, and then find out what the missing links and the missing pieces may be. Whether it's um, whether it's he don't have video on that page, uh, whether he needs a prospecting video, a sales pros prospecting video, whatever I see that missing link is and that missing piece, even if you don't take video of their business you have to take them some samples of that particular business and then show them the bottom line after you do some research a, a little bit of research on it of what this could mean on their ROI which is their return on their investment once they see what that return on their investment is what they're missing whether it's from advertising whether it's from getting traffic no matter what it is that's what that sweet spot is and that turning point to really get them to buy into that product. But that would be that for, and don't be afraid. You can't be afraid. You gotta get out there. You gotta either knock on doors, don't be afraid to knock on doors, and don't be afraid of no. I mean, it takes a person seven times to really talk to one person before that person says yes. So don't be afraid of no. No, no doesn't mean no. No means maybe not right now at this time. And then come back, come back, come back, come back, and then nail them. Yeah, I love it because um, when my kids were little, I learned that no means maybe and maybe means yes. And That's the right. best salespeople on the planet are kids. And if you don't believe me, go to Toys R Us and hang out there for about a half an hour and watch these little kids work their magic. And the parents got a whole shopping cart full of all this stuff. And then you couldn't get one more thing in there. And I was in there one time and I saw this kid that had to have this teddy bear. And she said, mommy already spent $300. And the kid threw a tantrum. Guess what? He got the, he got the bear in addition to everything else. So it's all about, you know, T. Harv Ecker talks about there's two kinds of entrepreneurs. You've got the, the, you know, and he's kind of in your face kind of guy. And he just tells it the way it is. He says you've got the meek, the weak, and the timid. Then you have the fearless warrior. You want to always be the fearless warrior. And do we all have fear? Absolutely. But you just got to push through it because that's where if you're not living, if you're if you're not living on the edge, you're taking up too much room. And you just got to get out of your comfort zone and make it happen. But I, you know, you're exactly right. And I love what you're talking about is you kept using the word show over and over and over. Show people, don't tell people. Show them. And people are really visual. And so when you're showing them, when you're going out there, like with uh, for the reseller program, we there's a reason why we put together an amazing time-tested PowerPoint that we've used thousands of times, thousands. And we know what works. We know what doesn't work. And when you visually engage people, that's when people get excited. And, of course, that's why video is so incredibly popular because – Every minute, there's almost 100 hours of video being uploaded just on YouTube. I mean, these are amazing times. What's going? I mean, this is like a gold rush at this very moment. Well, you know what I do now is if, if I don't, even if I don't even feel like um, engaging, I always, you know, 
eighty the twenty eighty rule. So you have to prospect. I mean that's that's your bread and butter, and that's where you gotta make your money. So if you have a video of what you're trying to do, you can walk into a prospects business establishment and press the after you get their attention, they want to talk to you, right. you can just press the video, press the whatever it is, press it and say, take a look at this and let that do the selling and say sure. any questions. And that's that's the way that's the way I operate, that's the way I do business, and that's the way I close deals. So I don't really have a difficult um, or hard time doing it because I'll either let a video or, or my iPhone, if I have videos on there, yeah. I let it do all the work for me and I just lay back and say any questions. Yeah, and that's what we do all day long. The identical thing is we have a 20 minute webinar that we've created and before we have conference calls with prospects or before we have a, you know, a group meeting, we make sure that they have watched that uh, webinar. If they haven't, we reschedule them. That's what we do, and it works. And we started doing that a couple of years ago. Our closing average doubled. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So, Corey, when you say, what did I do, first of all, yeah. and you talked about Les Brown a little bit, I was hungry. Hungry. <laughs> if, any, if anybody have ever heard Les Brown, he'll tell you about being hungry. So if you're hungry and you're starving, what are you going to do? You're going to eat. Yep. All right. So that's what I that's what I wanted, and it just over uh, exceeded anything that I could ever imagine, and it just blew up and went crazy, and I'm I'm grateful for it right now. So I still do a lot of prospecting. I still uh, put a lot of deals together. I still um, get out there every day, talk to somebody. I use the three foot rule. If you're three feet in front of me, you're gonna get sold. <laughs> I'm serious. I love it. You're going to get sold. Um, somebody's, I'm, I'm going to talk to you about something that I'm doing. You're going to refer me to a business owner or somebody that you know. Um, it, we're going to engage. And I engage with you, whether you're at the grocery store, whether you're at the dry cleaners, whether you're at the pizza place, whether I'm sitting down at Houston's having dinner, I whether I'm, I'm, I'm doing CrossFit right now. I mean, you talk to me about your business, I got a right to talk to you about mine. So this is a reciprocal thing and it's a give and take thing. So that's the way it is. I mean, I don't want to say that I'm overly aggressive, but I am. <laughs> you know? I'm very aggressive and uh, yeah, I just want things to happen. And you know, I'm at the stage in my life, and I must tell you this, is that I'm looking toward I just got back from Maui, Hawaii, and I spent seven days just tra seven days in Maui. Uh, seven days in the Caribbean, seven days in Tampa, and this is all all in the month of January. I just flew around, and man, I just want that lifestyle. I just I love it, and I and once you get out there and get exposed to all this these things and traveling and stuff, you just get this desire for what you want your life to look like, and that's where I am now. That's why I have that three foot rule right now. I mean, if you, if, I mean, if 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 Ira was in front of me right now, I'd be selling him something. You know, <laughs> so that's just the way it is. And, and the easiest people to sell in the world are other salespeople. That's right. They're the easiest, but no, I love, I love that. You know that I'm sure you you know what the acronym for ABC is, Mary. What is it? Always be closing. Oh yeah, oh yeah. yeah. So okay. I mean, that's you know, and so it's, and we have to, and for a lot of people, maybe. For whatever reason, we're always we're all wired a little different. Nobody was born a salesperson, mm -hmm. and you become an athlete by training. Become an athlete, for whatever sport that is. You become a pianist by pian by practicing that. Um, salespeople in general have the worst habits on the planet. They don't follow up. They don't make calls. They think everybody should come to them. It's kind of like I tell people. I say, look. The way you're the way you're running your business as far as prospecting, it's like going fishing, and you want all the fish to jump in your boat. You got to get out there. You got to make it happen, and no prisoners. And basically, that's it. I have a little bag around. As a matter of fact, I got it right next to me, and I'll show you this little bag right here. And it's not a little one, but it's a bigger bag. I carry my. This is what I carry my stuff in. So I always have it on me and if and if you're a guy you know you gotta figure out what it is and how you're gonna carry your 
carry your information with you. Yeah, <laughs> I always have it right yeah. on my shoulder, on my strap. So if I'm at if I'm at Publix, I can pull something pull something out to show somebody or a presentation. I mean, that's how I did it, Corey. When you say, Mary, how did you do 185 businesses in 30 days? That's the way I did it. I mean, I was just, when I went out, I went out with the mindset, okay, I'm going to the dry cleaners or I'm going to Kroger or I'm going to the Chinese restaurant, but I don't know who's going to be standing in front of me and I don't know who I'm going to meet and talk to, whether I pass them a business card or whether I get into a conversation about something, but that's how I did it. So, that's Mary, awesome. so, we, could, so we could safely say that you're on fire. Yeah. <laughs> and, you know, and that is the secret right there because, and you know, enthusiasm is contagious as a common flu and you've got to be on fire you, and because nothing great has ever happened without excitement and enthusiasm. And that really is the, that is, that's the key element that separates winning from losing. And one thing on that, so, and, and here's two things, actually, here's two things that you said, Mary, that were really awesome. Um, one of them was just push play. Right, because you took presentations and videos that did all the selling for you, and you just pressed play, and these bad boys did it for you. And that's great. That's awesome. I mean, that's that's total leverage because it means you don't even have to come up with the presentation. You 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 have these videos, and that's one of the things about our reseller channel and our, our video business in a box is you get video samples. You can just show them to your clients, put them on your iPad, put them on your phone, and just press play and. That's exciting because you can see the client's face when they're watching this and, and they say like, oh yeah, that's hot. I want one of those. It's, it's the total, you know, I've got to have one too factor. You know, if somebody's got this new gadget and they see their friend with it, they're like, that's really cool. How can I get one? It's the same thing. When you show them, it's the best way to do it. And so that's one of the things that you said that was really hot. And the second thing is is the three foot rule. I mean, that's that's uh, that's very valuable. I think people uh, people overlook that because there's people around you all the time. People that want to engage with you, people that want to buy your stuff, but you forget to really engage them. And so those are the two. Those are some of the two most amazing uh, takeaways that if you come away from this talk and this uh, this Google Places connection here. Take those away. The three foot rule and the just push play. Those are those are some really phenomenal uh, tips there, Mary. Well, you know, a lot of people they get they get around people, uh, and sometimes even if you set up a meeting and you run a Starbucks, I do that a lot. You know, I'll set up a meeting, I run run a Starbucks, I may grab my light, laptop or my iPad or whatever, but I always have something with me where I can just let. It, if I don't feel like really doing all the talking. I just have something with me, <clears throat> excuse me, where I can always show them exactly what it is I'm trying to convey. And I think that that's really, really important because sometimes you may not have all the pieces together. Sometimes you may not know exactly, you know, how this is going to fit into that prospect's mind or how is it going to fit into that prospect's business. But if you have it all laid out for you, all of the points laid out for you, then you don't have to worry about remembering what to say. And then if they have any questions about what you just showed them, you can nine out of 10 expound on that. You can explain it. You can say something about it. And then you can set up the next meeting or it may be something that they want to just go ahead on and get today. You know, you may close it right then and there. And sometimes that may be just, you know, a little difficult or you know if it doesn't work right away like I said give it time and and follow up you know what was it in that video that you saw what did you like what did you think and get them telling you what they like and then after they tell you one or two or maybe three things that they liked then those are the things that you go back over and over and over again and close them on that is so funny. <laughs> you see what Corey's doing? He puts a patch on his eye and all this kind of crazy stuff. <laughs> so you, you, he's doing everything he can to distract me. But see, no, don't sorry. Get distracted. whatever you do, don't let anybody get distracted. Well, which one do you like better? This you like this look? You like? Uh, <laughs> yeah, that's cool too. I like that. But you know what? Get get that number. I like that too. That's cool. I like that one a lot better. <laughs> but um, pick the number. This is the this is the beginning of March. What's what's your number at the end of March? Okay, 
Is it that you need to make an extra 500 bucks? Hmm. Okay. Or is it that you need to make an extra grand? Pick your number. You know, I don't want to pick something out the box because I want to pick something realistic. Or it may be that you just need to make a couple of two, couple, couple hundred dollars. Whatever that number is, pick it and go out there and do it. I love it. So, Mary, question for you. Yeah. Um, you obviously are, you are, when you go out there, you are like this evangelist regarding your product or service, correct? Mm hmm And wouldn't you agree that anybody that's selling anything, number one, they have to believe in that product, they have to know a hundred times more than their prospect, and they have to feel that if their prospect doesn't buy this, that they're letting them down because it's that good? That's right. You know, Absolutely. And, I, and Absolutely. so I believe... I believe that that is, and, and that's, and when you believe that you're letting them down if they don't buy this because it's that viable, that then you can go seven, eight, nine, ten no's without offending anybody because they can see you're coming from a place of being truly authentic. It's kind of like if you were a scientist, Corey used to be a scientist, and you're well, in the lab. Well, look at Corey right now. He's, he's <laughs> got the handlebars, a mustache, and then he's got um, the... Uh, is it Alicia? She has the, uh, yeah. the, the, the goggle glasses. I don't know if folks can see this or not, but it is. Yes, we, we got Ashley in a, in a tank Ashley. right now. <laughs> yeah. Ashley, yeah. So it's crazy. Oh, my gosh. That's very nice. Yeah, yeah so. But this you're is, so right. Yeah, so, Mary, this is what I work with all day long. This is, this, oh, my this God. Is, this is what I put up with. Uh, so. <laughs> I tell you, it's crazy. But you know what? I wanna, I wanna kiss it. You know what they say? <laughs> I wanna keep it simple. Keep it I simple. Wanna, yeah, keep it simple, and don't think that you don't get analysis by paralysis. You know, don't get. I gotta do this. I gotta do this. Or I gotta say this. Or just chill out and just be yourself. And you, you've read over the information. You got video. Watch a few videos. But the main thing is. Put one foot in front of the other and get out there and do it. Yeah. And the more the more you get out there and you practice closing, um, you're just going to get better and better and better. And when you get to the very end, um, don't stop at the first no. Just, you know, and it's and I was at an event a while back and somebody said something very interesting. Do not be afraid to challenge your prospect. Right. And don't let them off the hook because if you get, you know, great selling is nothing more than asking great questions up front. Mm -hmm. And so if you tell, if you ask somebody a question, well, how long have you been thinking about, you know, um, increasing your revenue? He says, oh, about two years I've been struggling. So then at the very end, he says, I got to think about this. Well, you know, Mary, I'm a little confused. You told me you've been thinking about this for two years. You know, what are you going to know between now and next week that you don't know right now? Your problem is not going to go away by itself. And then just keep asking great questions. And it's really, if you ask the right questions, you'll always get the right answers. And I know you ask great questions. Correct? Yeah, absolutely. And, and that is so true. And you know what? You do have to ask the right questions. But my biggest thing is if you knew and don't know um, know the information that well and not quite as comfortable with knowing which questions to ask okay again let that video do it I can't overstress that yeah. I can't overstress that or get your presentation and sometimes even when you get into a presentation you feel like you should be going faster or you're going too slow or whatever <laughs> get that video out and let that video do it and then you'll begin to feel more comfortable with what you're doing and then you'll begin to build up that credibility and feel like you know the questions to ask. I, what, I, I want, what I want these guys to do is I want them to take it easy on themselves because sometimes folks can be too hard on themselves. I want them to get out there and put 25 business cards in somebody's hand every day. That's what I do. 25 business cards in somebody's hands every day. And I talk to at least three people every day about my product or service. And that's exactly what you have to do. I love it. I love it. Um, 
Corey, isn't this amazing? Oh, this is this is hot this is stuff. The stuff we talk about all day long. This is, I mean, right, Ashley? Absolutely. So this is the cool thing about um, the community that you. By the way, you can do these really cool faces and stuff. Hey, how do you do that? I want to know. I don't know how to do it. So you go to Google Hangouts and. Okay, I'm in Google. On Hangouts. Google Hangouts, there's Google Effects, and and you can actually see all of these come up. And I'm on a randomizer. And I can actually randomize things, and all of a sudden I've got a different combo. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> We've got sound effects um, and really cool random stuff. Uh, I patch kitty. Anyway, uh, so that's one of the cool oh, things. Oh, I, I see the Google effects right here. Yeah, <laughs> it's it's pretty baller. So one of the things you can kind of play around with when you get some time. Um, okay. Or when you have too much time. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. Oh my god, that's crazy. <laughs> now I don't know how to get these things off my face. Well, you know what? <laughs> so What's going to happen is on your face, huh? that's going to be on your face for the rest of your life. <laughs> yeah, apparently. That's too funny. It's like, okay, now how do you, oh, I see. I see oh, they're over here. Okay. And I see the sounds and all that. Isn't that something? Okay, Ira, you're going to have to get yours. So you, can, you finally got it off, huh? I got it off. Whew. little plastic surgery there. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, it's um, but no, this is great. And so what I want to do, because we're gonna we're gonna talk about some stuff. Then we're gonna wrap up and give everybody okay. their special prizes. Because we we literally recorded a sales presentation earlier today. It was all recorded, guys. Everybody that's on here, it was so phenomenal and actually caught me by surprise. I wasn't even ready for it. Um, but Mary's like so pumped. She's like, I just signed up for the reseller program. Uh, you told me to go out and get a case study. Here he is. Let's get him on Google Play, Google Hangouts, and she did it. She did it right off the bat. Got him on. He was on there within a couple of minutes, and we talked for about 45 minutes. Did an entire strategy session live and recorded it, which was great. And uh, it's got some really killer stuff in it. And this stuff isn't really that difficult, guys. And and um, might take some getting used to, but I want to give that to you. So all of you guys that stay on till the very end. You are going to get that replay. Um, it's something that we probably wouldn't offer at all. In fact, it was only by chance that we recorded it because Google was actually recording it for us, which is phenomenal. But I want Mary to kind of walk us through that a little bit because we just threw that together. She literally signed up uh, as a reseller just the other day, hopped on, said, "Hey, you know, I want, you know, I've got this prospect here. Let's do some deals." And the cool thing about it is this deal, this video deal. Is not going to be just a, a small video deal, a thousand dollars or even just five thousand dollars. Potentially, this could be a much larger deal, and so I want you to kind of take us through just a little bit, Mary, of uh, you know, kind of uh, uh, what it took to kind of line that deal up and and uh, and and how it went and, and what we're going to do as a result of it. So just kind of fill us in just a little bit. Take a couple minutes to do that. Well, remember when I said the three foot rule? Okay. Yeah. Oh, totally. So that that's great. So I just happened to be talking. Well, I called my friend to talk to his wife about CrossFit because she's the one that introduced me. And I am going to sign up the guys at CrossFit. If you guys haven't done CrossFit yet, okay, you need I to do it, it, right? Yep. So, um, which is totally awesome. It's just another story for another day. But anyway, we were talking, and I said, I just told him, I reminded him of something that he said before. Remember when you said such and such and such about you needed more to get more leads, you needed to get more customers? Well, I got somebody awesome that I want, want you to talk to. And what we're going to do is we're going to put together, and I didn't even explain to him everything what we were going to put together because remember when I was talking about how your mind may be going so fast that you want to get this information out but you really don't know how to get it out? So you got to kind of, it's almost like you got to pace yourself and start collecting your thoughts. And once I told him about Corey, I was able to calm myself down and tell him that I wanted him to be a case study because I knew that he had these 500 travel agents, 500 that potentially can use the product of getting videos. So I wanted to start with him and then begin to start working my deal with him. And I let him know that there is going to be some cost involved. You always let them know that, even if they're going to be a case study or whatever it's going to be. There's going to be some cost involved, but the ROI, the return on the investment, is going to be far greater than anything 
than you could ever imagine. Mm -hmm. So yeah. that's exactly what I told him. And yeah. I got him on the phone with us, and he was right here hanging out with us at Google Hangout, had some very intelligent questions for us. And then, then Corey brainstormed a little bit on how, and I don't, I, well, I don't want to see, I don't want to see, okay, how we can get him. I don't want to say hook him, but <laughs> how, how, how we can take it to the next level. You gotta how, you can, how, you can, how you can close the deal, how you can ice the deal, how you can lock it down. How, how we can lock it down, how we can close the deal, you know. And if he, if you ever see this, you know what I mean, because you're in a business too. <laughs> well, he's got to respect the hustle. Yeah, and if you if you don't know what we're talking about, you really haven't gotten out there and gotten in front of people because that's really what this game is all about. It's all right. about closing deals and getting in front of people. And this was a prospect that potentially usually be a little bit like, well, I know everything, and and you know, I you know, there's nothing really I need right now. But he was very open, and uh, it was it was great, and 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 uh, just took him through a process, asked him. We, you know, I asked him a couple questions, I, and these are the questions that I, we asked because I, I didn't know anything about him when he got on. I didn't know, I, I knew his name, his first name. That was about it. And so I was like, you know, what's? I asked him. This was the first question. I was, what's your website? Okay, cool. Let me go check that out. And then I asked him, okay, cool. So, so where are we at? I, I asked, told him to ask, tell me a little bit about his company, and, and so he spilled the beans and told me where he's at. And the cool thing about this whole game is like when you're doing this, you can find out where people are at revenue-wise because you can find out. Okay, cool. You know how many customers do you have? Okay, good. And then you can find out what's the average worth of a customer on a monthly basis. So now you're just what you're doing is you're asking subtle little questions in order to arrive at what they're profiting at. Because when you know that, you can form a, a you can kind of see what ballpark they're in. I always like to know what kind of business they're doing because that gives me a feel if this is going to be a, a small baby deal or a bigger deal. Mm -hmm. And that's that's highly important. So that was the first question, you know, what's your traffic like to your website? You told us a little bit about that. How many leads are you collecting? How many customers do you currently have? What's the average worth of a of a current client? What kind of traffic are you pushing to your site? And then he told us that he was doing all kinds of things and then you know, we just kept breaking it down and breaking it down and breaking it down, and finally we arrived at a solution um, because this was this is plain cold. I, I didn't know the guy at all, but we came up with a valid solution that this guy could offer using video and using mobile to literally double and and triple the amount of revenue he's doing currently. And and we we arrived at that within the span of you know maybe 20 minutes. And we're able to, to, to draw it out for him and map out, hey, this is the game plan and this is what we think will work for you. And, it's, and we'll give that to you. I want you guys to study that recording, okay, because that's, that's incredibly important. Uh, it's nothing different than what you're going to do when you're out there. Uh, be very mindful that when I started in this game, I had no idea what I was doing, and I just asked a ton of questions to prospects because there was, that was the best thing to do rather than kind of spout my mouth off and trying to throw out suggestions, and I had zero clue about that. Just ask really, really valuable questions. And, and what were some of the other things maybe that you found in that session, Mary, that were important for some people to learn about how we kind of brought him from totally cold where he was at right right then he had a relationship with you didn't know me at all um, and brought him you know brought him over here all the way to you know very interested and now ready to move forward on some level well one of the things I know and I do know this guy he's the type of person and I don't know if you guys have ever seen the commercial where it's a guy laying on like a gurney or something like that and he's getting ready to take the scalpel and do surgery on himself, heart surgery. So he's going to cut his chest open and began to fix the pieces in it. Well, this guy is the type of guy that's all decks hands on. And I really had to explain to him, sometimes you can't do everything yourself. You know, you got to let the professionals handle it for you. So I had that in my mind. And some of, I knew that some of the things that he really wanted and the main thing he wanted was to get over 50 leads a day. Now, for me and for you, 50 leads a day may be a lot. You know, for him, for him, he wants at least 100 leads a day. So what we did was, it's called the hook, path, and persuasion. So you, you kind of bring them in and hook them in to where you want to take them, take them down a path, and that's the path that Corey and I start taking him down with the solutions that we were giving him. And now it's a, it, it's a part of persuading him. 
for me to persuade him that this is the type of thing that he really needs needs to take his business to the next level. His questions just really were traffic generation, how to get traffic generation, um, doing traffic as it relates to the mobile, the cost of mobile versus regular Google, because that's really big, you know. And we let him know that you know what is no comparison because the traffic that you're going to do on mobile, mobile, even if you have an opt-in page, is going to they're going to opt in and they're going to get a video as a result of it. That video had to be something really special. Now, we let them know that you may have videos that you have created in the past, but this video has got to be something that's really going to take your prospect exactly where you need them to go. And that's really what he wanted to know. And it was like, okay, okay, you know, you know, let's, let's get back. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to follow back up with him. And I'm not going to bug him or anything like that, but I'm going to follow back up with him and I'm going to keep going through it, through, through, just through questions, talking to him, and just trying to bring him over to, um, to, to ultimately a sale, to ultimately close the deal. Yeah. So that's, that's what I'm going to do. Yeah, and you know, here's the thing. This video that we're, we're looking at doing with this guy, potentially $20,000 or more, for one single video, because it's a more ornate, it's a more well done video. It's a sales video essentially, but um, I mean that's a large sale, and there's lots of you know there's lots of, uh, of revenue there for everybody to really be involved. But I mean you can do that too. I mean there's clients like this everywhere. There's simply everywhere, and we we run across some amazing clients every single day. For instance, today we just did a we did a small deal, uh, five thousand sold a five thousand dollar video to. Um, what is it, the Arizona State Bar Association? I why don't you tell us just a couple minutes and, and tell us a little bit about that? Yeah. Um, so we found this gal. My daughter goes to a lot of networking events, and she's amazing at networking. And so um, she's on a roll right now. She's loading up our calendar. So and so Corey and I also go out there. And so I had a meeting with this. Um, uh, it was the Arizona Board of. Um, uh, of actually it was attorneys as a bar association and they have some initiative that um, they needed a video for and they got a grant and this is going to be the they're the first ones in the country to do something like this and they said that this will lead the way and they're going to be pioneers and this will be done in all 50 52 states so this is going to lead to something really well the meeting went so well that they they, they at the end they suggested that they want to put us on their website within a, and just promote us that's how well the meeting went because I gave them so much value and they you know when they when I left they it, I blew their minds because the information I brought was exactly what they needed so they felt like they really got educated I gave them the right solution I showed them the appropriate videos that tied into them so it was a very prestigious um, client, and what's really cool is the, the one of the gals that was in this meeting is a grant writer, and she got so excited about our bigger projects, she's going to start tomorrow and write a ask for a grant for a lot, lot more money, and so they're going to be getting all kinds of services from us just because of that one meeting today. Amazing. That's awesome. No, that's killer. And uh, and here's and here's here's the cool thing about that is that you know it's just networking. Networking is what led to that deal. Going out there, meeting a prospect, and lining up a strategy session, and closing the deal. It's it's the same thing that you can go out there and do, armed with our information, with our sample videos, get in front of them, show them the coolness, and because the deals like that are out there, people want video. It's not like something years ago. It was, it was, you know, people maybe would thought, ah, you know, I don't need video and stuff like that. These days, people know they need video. It's a, it's, it's, it's something that they, they've looked at, they've wanted to do for a while. Maybe they tried to do it, maybe it didn't have results. And you know, you're gonna get people that says, well, I have a video, it didn't do much for me. Well, okay, so let's talk about that. The, the natural, that uh, natural reaction for some people is to back off and say, okay. Well, they already did video and all that stuff. Well, the reality is, if they did video themselves or they had it done by somebody else, well, I mean, that's that's probably why they didn't have any results. Why not let us do? You know, have us do a video. This is how you would phrase it. Have have my company do a video because that's what what's going to help you get the results. 
because we've been doing this for so long. And, and so that's another reason to kind of like avoid that objection and get your foot in the door and say, hey, I know you did video over here, but if you did it yourself, that's probably the reason why it didn't go so well. So now you need to, to, to re hit the reset button. Video does work. It, all, the, all the stats prove it. All the results we've had with clients prove it. So now it can work for you. We've just got to find the way to do it. You know, so let's Corey, video so, um, uh, converts, um, makes more money in converting than any other medium that I've ever seen. Yep. Um, and I've been in internet marketing um, for like five years now and I've studied just you know I've, I've, I have put my time in and studying and the number one thing that I've seen that converts better than anything else is when a person actually visually can relate to that video. Exactly. So my highest recommendation would be is the low-hanging fruit Pick the low-hanging fruit of folks that you already have relationships with and work those people first because 9 out of 10, um, you won't get a no and they probably will try one part of your product and then just, just try to make that the case study. You know, let them know that you're doing a case study and that it's going to be some cost involved, yep. some hard cost involved and, um, you know, let's see how it go. And do that. You can just say it like that. Let's see how it goes. And then if it goes well, then we can get into some of the other products and services that we have to offer. Yeah, I like it because the key, we use that all the time. Is and I look at each client that we bring on as a case study, and everybody wants to be a case study because mm -hmm. their perception is they're going to we're going to go above and beyond and do more for them. And so, and we, we, we go, we over deliver for every client that we have. So, uh, you're absolutely right. It's, um, you know, w w go ahead, Corey, you're going to say something. Yeah. And here's the thing. It, and we were talking about this cause this is exactly what happened today with Mary's prospect is that she went out and told him that, Hey, we want to make you a case study. <laughs> so it was like, it's like, okay, well, who doesn't want to be a case study? Everybody wants to be a case study because it means you're going to put in a lot more effort into that. And so, you know, everybody, when you say something like that, and we use this all the time, um, you know, and, and it, it works very well if you tell your client, yeah, we want to turn you into a case study. And the reality is, whether you have one client or you have a hundred clients, you want all your clients to be case studies. Yeah. You want all of them to be testimonials and success stories and, and, and just give you amazing feedback and make a video and say to all of anybody out there on the interwebs how awesome your company was and how amazing that video was that you produced for him and what it did and all that stuff. You want that for all your clients. So when you're telling them, hey, I want you to be a case study. We want to you know, feature you and, uh, and really turn you into our, one of our poster children. That is a hook that really grabs and grips a lot of people and it, it makes them feel better about working with you. It's kind of strange, but it really works. And it worked today here that in, in something Mary just tried just, on, uh, you know, just, just like that. People. Yeah, and one of the things I just wanted to say is um, people are afraid to ask for the order or ask, you know, hey, look, this is, this, this is, act, ask them, you know, it, it doesn't hurt. And like I said, let them know up front that there is, because people think, oh, a case study, well, you know, this is going to be free. No, nothing is free. Um, the best things in life are free, but you can give them to the birds and beads. You know, I really want, you know, you want, you got to get money because that's how you eat, okay? So you got to let them know that there are going to be, there's going to be some, you know, and you can say it like hard cost and, you know, you'll do what you can, but there's, there's going to be some cost involved. And then you can start breaking it down from the price sheet and then, you know, pick a, pick a price, let them pick out, you know, what would be more better for them. That's, that, that's really how I sell. Yeah. And that's perfect. And, and here's the cool thing. So here's what we're doing. Is is and you're really witnessing the launch of something because um, Mary is actually our, our one of our uh, guinea pigs. We're actually launching something. It's the we're, we're coming up with the name for it. We don't have a name. We call the Just Do It program. The uh, uh, you know the, we've got some other things we're flying around. But in the end, what we're doing with Mary is she just signed up for the reseller program, and we're going to be documenting this um, Mary's first sale of video because she's. You know, she's worked with clients. She sold mobile um, mobile apps and mobile development and some other services. Never sold video. Obviously, she knows that. And just like everybody.
anybody else on this call. That video is hot right now and that so many businesses want to buy it. And so um, we're turning Mary into a case study because now she's going to go out there and sell some video and we're going to document all of it. We're going to, you're going to be able to watch Mary as she progresses through that and start selling videos. And you know, my, my guess is she won't sell just one. I mean, she'll sell a whole slew of them in a very short amount of time. And that's what I'm excited about. And what I'm excited for you is how you can learn these strategies because they work. And we would just want to show everybody that you can do it too, no matter who you are, no matter what your circumstances are. There's nothing holding you back from doing this and making your first video sale uh, in a very short amount of time. And so, you know, we want to take away basically all of the mystery out of doing this, and that's why we're documenting every piece of it. And we started just today, and we got on the phone with somebody and, and, and got had a call with what will probably result in a $20,000 or more sale for Mary and recurring income potentially over, over the next year, which will be great. So, um, so we're going to keep tabs on Mary. Uh, we're going to we call the, the, the program, you know, See Mary Sell. Um, whatever we're going to call it in the end, um, but I think it's it's going to go really well, and, and I'm excited for you guys to listen in, to, to, to come behind the scenes and watch this actually happen, um, because it'll give you uh, it'll give you all the, the knowledge you need that the things that you're doing is is what you need to be doing. There's no there's no magic to it. There's uh, there's no uh, black box secrets to it. Everything that you need, we've already given you. Now it's just time to execute. So so over the next uh, couple weeks and the next 30 days, we're going to be walking and seeing Mary take action on this entire program. Go out there and sell video from scratch, never having sold video before, and uh, it's going to be exciting. And I'm I'm pumped for it. How would you like to just look over my shoulder <laughs> and watch step by step of how I do it? And that's what we're going to be demonstrating to you, is to be able to just look over, just like you're here now, look over my shoulder, walk in with me, go through the process with me, and to be able to make it happen, and to be able to overcome objections, to be able to get comfortable in your own skin, and to be able to go out there and share a product and service with your potential prospect that they already need that will help them. That's what we're going to be doing. Perfect. Well, I'm, I'm pumped about it and uh, we're going to do that. We're going to make it happen. The deals are out there. The checks have already been written. These businesses are already buying this stuff. The only question is, are they going to buy it from you? Because sooner or later, I mean, if you go to a business, you'll find out that they bought a video or they bought a mobile website or they bought PPC or SEO. They're doing it. Why? Because you know, this isn't the days of 2009 where everybody was just totally balled up and tightened up and not spending a penny. This is a new age. This is this is 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 really kind of the the, the turn that everybody has turned the corner. People are now spending money. They're ready to do it. They see that they need results. They want to take it to the next level. You're their company to do it with. You get. You just got to be there. And uh, Ira says this has been around for a while. Ninety percent of success is just showing up. And you know when you're there and you're in front of them, you stand to, to gain a lot. Um, and I'll throw it over to Ira. We're going to have some closing statements, and then we got a very special offer for you guys here today that you're going to love. Mary, you look good there. I like that. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Hey, you can tell I've been hanging around with Corey too long. Yeah. Huh? <laughs> it's um, but it, and the other thing I just want to I want to just throw out. Corey, should I, should I quickly throw out my signature one two ten forty? Talk about that for a second. <laughs> uh, yeah, you can talk about it. We mentioned it many times, but yeah, just quickly. Go right. Quickly. So, Mary, you've never heard this, but it's uh, happy birthday, Mary. Um, I, I have a formula that I created many, many years ago. It's called the one two ten forty. You're gonna love it, Mary. And that is uh, the one represents you spend an hour a day on the phone. Um, calling up people with the sole purpose of setting at least, very nice, setting at least two appointments a day so that you're face-to-face, belly-to-belly. So that means uh, you're talking to 10 people a week at a minimum. Um, that means you're talking to 40 people in a month. That means you're talking to 500 people a year. Now, if you're only talking to two people a week, and a lot of people are, I'm talking to, people that are out there right now that are talking to maybe one person a week, maybe, and they wonder why they're struggling. You've got to, you've got to get in front of at least one or two people 
every day at a minimum. You talk about three people a day. But if you're only talking to two people a week, that's under 100 people a year. If you're talking to two people a day, you go from 100 people a year to 500 people a year. That's how we've helped and coached all these entrepreneurs on how to double and triple revenue. And we have client after client after client after client that is crushing it right now because they're following these really simple formulas. It's really old school marketing with new technology that we've created and we've fused it all together. So it's the most exciting time right now. And you don't have to go to Alaska for the gold. It's right in your own community. It's right in your own backyard. And if you want a million dollars, it's already been printed. You just have to give enough value to enough people and solve their problems. And that's my story, and I'm sticking to it. <laughs> you know, I think that it would be good that if you guys um, set up a separate uh, private Facebook page and call it the local hero page so they can be the local hero in their area. Oh, I and like that. They can come on that page and talk about different issues, objections. I mean, this is a private page that they're having, and we can go in there and answer those questions for them, and I'll try to answer them in real time so wow. that they can get feedback right away. Now, if that don't do it for you, I don't know what will. Okay. <laughs> well, we're going to offer actually a very cool thing here, and, and that's a great point, um, is that we're actually going to, and let me see if I can do this. I've never done this before. I'm going to show my screen here um, using the Google Hangout and see if I can make that happen. I'm going to go full screen. Mary, I was telling Corey today that we're doing everything but going on, but going out and finding the prospects and closing them for them with Isn't all the truth? things we're giving them. <laughs> Isn't that the truth? Hey, I don't mean to do this, guys, but he has me having a good time. <laughs> <laughs> well, here and so here's what I want to do because um, real quick before we we kind of wrap this up, and you guys have been okay. awesome here today. Um, can you guys see my screen okay? It so shows yeah. Mojo video. Mar okay, yes. good. Um, so here's what I want to do because this is we're offering something very awesome here, and we're offering what's called the Mojo Inner Circle. And this Mojo Inner Circle, um, right now you you are a reseller of Mojo services. You are, have the ability to go out there and sell video. This is the price points that you get. So basically, um, you know, a silver level video. You know, five hundred bucks you can sell it for. You can sell basically. you you can you can take that and sell it for a thousand dollars or two thousand dollars and sell it. And you your cost to you is five hundred bucks. That's how great these quality of videos are. This one you can make. You can generate a couple thousand dollars off of this platinum one. You can sell for five thousand up to five thousand dollars. The video we just sold today, five thousand dollars is what we sold it for. That's a platinum video, and or even could be a gold video. So. When you're selling one of these videos, you can generate you know thirty four hundred dollars or 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 more in one video sale. And for for a lot of you guys, I mean, all you really need to do to cover your expenses is sell one video, which is awesome. So in animated videos, you can sell those for seventy five hundred all the way to ten thousand. So what we want to do is actually offer you the chance to actually do some do some to increase your profits because that's what we talked about how to double your sales or double your profits on your next video order. So let me go through that and show you exactly what that looks like because we've actually got a very cool thing. It's called the Mojo Inner Circle. I want to show you exactly what that is um, because right now you've got these videos that you can sell at these prices and what I want to do is offer them at an even much more discounted rate for you. And so we're offering you um, discounts on already wholesale prices. Okay, and this is only available for Mojo Inner Circle peeps. Okay, and uh, it gives you a forty percent additional off uh, additional off the video. And obviously, I can't spell, um, but it's forty percent off videos um, from what they already are. So that means, and let me show this to you. Okay, that if you got a, a retail platinum video, you can sell that for five thousand dollars. Okay. Um, that's what um, that's what you get the business owner to pay. That's not what you're paying. Your wholesale price right now is sixteen hundred dollars. And by joining the Mojo Inner Circle, okay, and uh, you get access to forty percent reduction, which gives you a, a you get a video for nine hundred and sixty dollars versus sixteen. 
1600 means, which means you're saving an additional $640 that goes right into your pocket. It's a video you would have normally sold anyway, um, only now you get $640 in additional money back into your pocket. And so here's the cool thing about it. You go and sell this video for five grand, and now you're putting an you're putting four thousand dollars into your pocket versus normally thirty four hundred. So now you've just maximized your your ROI. You're earning four thousand dollars per video sale on a, a re, on a platform, <coughs> you know, which is awesome. And so we're offering this to you. It's part of the Mojo Inner Circle. It's a private club. You've got to be part of the club. You do not get these discounts uh, if you're not part of the club. You can go sell them at the at the other rates that we we give to you. Okay. And here's the other thing you're going to get with the monthly mastermind, the, the, with the Mojo Inner Circle, is a monthly mastermind where you get access to VIP masterminds and be on the line with Corey, Ira, and even Mary as we go through this. I uh, personally take an in-depth look at your company and give you top suggestions and tips on the best way to get clients. We're going to be working with you guys more hand in hand. Mary, when she's available, uh, as we go through this, and we're of course um, taking Mary through some some very cool masterminds as well. Uh, we're we're really um, excited to offer this to you guys, and this is this is more because what people wanted is a little bit more like hey how do I do this or they want to run something by us or they want to you know today I gave somebody an idea she's she's uh, got a local marketing consultant business in in uh, Portland Oregon she's been a doctor for 27 years and uh, I told her yeah the best brand you could have is the local marketing doctor and I told her to go out and brand that the heck out of that. And so she's going to make a ton of money off that brand because you know, the, and and that one idea could very well mean that she'll she'll double or triple her profits because she gets more people looking at her. So, as part of this inner circle, you also get access to VIP masterminds with um, with with myself and Ira, and Mary. Uh, you know, when she's available to take an in-depth look at your company, and also prospecting calls. And this is something that we just kind of formulated here because we saw that there was a need for it. But the we will we'll help you close deals for you. You can just get us on the on the line and and uh, it's a Google Hangout kind of deal, and we'll help you close the deals. And, uh, and 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 that's that. I don't know anybody that can really do that. And whether it's white labeled, so it looks like we're part of your company or whatever, it's it's all good. We'll take them through the entire selling process. So we'll do you know a couple of those a month for you. Where we'll actually show you how we close deals and actually help you close your clients. We want to help you close your your first client or your hundredth client, and so we're going to do that all when you're part of the Mojo Inner Circle. And so, here's what it is: it's the Inner Circle offer. This is something that you know. If we're going to really, the value on this is incredible um, because if you you know if you're selling videos and you're you're, you're di literally doubling the you're, you're maximizing your profit on your videos. You're getting 40% discount on our already wholesale prices. You're getting us on a mastermind. You're having us help you close deals right on the line with your prospects. And so here's all it is. It's 97 bucks a month. This is a charter membership. This will go up. Uh, and uh, But we want to give you the guys this as, as, as a gift, our gift to you. And uh, so please take advantage of it. All you got to do is go here, mojovideo.org slash inner circle. Take full advantage of it. This is a 12-month commitment, so this isn't something that, you know, this is a 12-month commitment. Just want to throw that out there. Um, you know, and we, we do that just so, you know, uh, we just kind of make sure that, um, that you're committed to doing this. We're committed to you. We want to see the same commitment out of you. And uh, that's all it is. It's 97 bucks a month, mojovideo.org slash inner circle. And go ahead and take full advantage of that offer. This is really only for those people on the line because um, this is pro this video, pro we, you know, I'm not even sure if the, the replay happened, if the recording took place. You know, this is, this, is, this is new technology for everybody. So hopefully there is a replay. I would take it full advantage of this right now because this, uh, like, like our prices always do as we're launching this thing will go up and so just to re just to summarize everything you get access to a month you get monthly masterminds with uh, myself and Ira you also get um, uh, get access to uh, discounts 40 percent discounts on the already wholesale prices okay and you also uh, we will even a couple times a month get on and help you close some of the the prospects that you're working with live on the line which is great um, and so let's see. 
As a bonus, can we get access to your uh, autoresponder video and emails? Yeah, we will actually, you know, as we go along, that's one of the first things we'll be going over, Keith, is we'll be going over some of the emails that we send out and some of the autoresponders and how that has helped us get more business. So this is all part of the mastermind. We are giving you some ninja stuff. This is stuff in the mastermind that we don't give anybody else because it's too valuable. And so this is something that only um, that's going to be super top secret. It's only going to we're only going to share some of the stuff with the mastermind, and uh, and we're happy to do that. But you know, there, go ahead and sign up if you want um, to take advantage of this. Uh, this does not include the Mojo software, so um, this is separate than the Mojo software. So um, you know, but uh, thanks for asking. Uh, just so you know. Um, but uh, but that's always something that you can take full advantage of. But you are getting some amazing things, additional discounts on videos, access to uh, the mastermind on a monthly basis. We'll do hot seats. We'll take a look at your marketing, your company. We'll give you specific and strategic ideas that you can use right away, right now, about uh, you know about things that you can that will help you make money in the next week. We're very big on closest to revenue. And we're, there's, there's nothing more important to us than having a, our resellers be big wins. And, and uh, we're excited about working with you hand in hand to make sure that happens. So uh, there you go. If you have any questions, go to the chat box on the, on the GoToWebinar um, to ask. Or you can go to Facebook. Um, it's fa or you can look us up on Facebook. Um, if you're not in the GoToWebinar, uh, if you logged out of the GoToWebinar, um, you can go to Facebook.com uh, slash Mojo Video Marketing. Uh, so the same con you off in your group coaching. Um, yeah, Keith, this is this is different than the Matrix. Um, this is total hands-on coaching. What are your What are the big things that you need help with? This is your access to us to ask us on a on a monthly basis how you can you know how we can help you grow your business immediately. We've seen it all when it comes to doing deals, when it comes to big deals, small deals. We'll help you overcome objections. We'll help you give. Uh, help you be able to maximize your profits from these deals and and do it live on on the on the um, on the mastermind calls as well as help you close deals which is as I know one of the most significant things that we can do because if we can help you close your first deal or your tenth deal and just help you close your first video deal it's gonna get you super pumped and you'll be able to close a lot more um, there we go so, uh, so we're going to wrap this up. Anything else on that, Ira, before we kind of wrap yeah, this up? I just want to, uh, I'm kind of a numbers guy, and I like to always uh, do the math. Let's just say you're planning on sent, selling at least, you know, one video a week or one video every other week. If you're planning on selling one video a week and you saved an extra, say, $600, uh, you know, over a month, that's twenty-four hundred dollars. That would be extra money that would go into your pocket. So twenty-four hundred dollars times twelve. I mean, you're looking at thirty, forty thousand dollars. So even if you cut that number in half of how many videos you're going to sell, you're looking at thousands and thousands of dollars. Uh, eventually, this will be a, a five hundred to a thousand dollar a month service uh, because. You know, you, you get both of us. Uh, you know, we our private consultations typically. You know, I charge between five hundred to thousand dollars an hour, and Corey's uh, is very similar. And so to get, you know, to have access to us for ninety-seven dollars a month is like, I mean, anybody that's on this call right now is a case study, and that's not a sales pitch because you are a case study. Otherwise, I wouldn't do this for ninety-seven bucks. So we're just wanting and and the and the services and the and the and the product that you're getting, uh, the video business in a box. Basically, we've given this to you for free. I mean, it's free, and you pretty much, everybody knows that. Um, and we can sell that product for five grand all day long. But we we've got a bunch of people out there we want to be successful. But for ninety seven dollars a month, that's the price of going out to dinner with your family. I mean, are you kidding me? If you go to Starbucks every day, you'll spend more than $97 a month. So it's not like, you know, it, it really would have come, this is not for everybody. If you don't plan on crushing it this year and you're just going to kind of limp along, don't spend the $97 a month, you know. Um, take the $97 a month and uh, take some more motivational courses. 
uh, <laughs> or whatever. But, uh, but seriously, uh, what you want to do is ask yourself a real question. Am I in or am I not in? If you're in, this is a total no-brainer. Wouldn't you agree, Mary? Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. I should have known that Corey and Ira had something up their sleeve when I mentioned in Facebook that you guys had like an inner circle uh, to offer. I mean, that that offer is something that is amazing. And you can't, I mean, you can't get anything like that anyplace else on the face of the earth. Um, and these two guys are just totally amazing guys with knowledge wisdom and information to share with you to help you get going to help you move through the process of whether it's closing your first second third fourth fifth deal it doesn't matter I mean it's worth it and you can't even put a price on it and like Ira said you know this is basically giving it to you and you know you can't just give anything away you, you have to really really have some skin in the game and this gives you the opportunity to have some skin in the game, to have that commitment, to have that focus, to be able to go to where you want to go and to be able to make the kind of money that you want to make in your life. So I urge you, I urge you at this moment to go ahead on, jump into this. You're going to get so much and that and more out of it and you're going to be so fulfilled within yourself. It's just going to be totally incredible. So you get it. I look forward to seeing you guys, talking to you guys, and letting you guys know what's going on. Thank Perfect. you, Gary. That's um, we're just really excited to work with everybody, and um, it's kind of like this. You know, you take the first step, we'll take the rest with you, and we are uh, so committed. We want to help ten thousand entrepreneurs in the next twelve to eighteen months, and we are absolutely going to do that. We. We are committed to that. Our path and purpose and vision and mission has not changed one centimeter in the last four years. It's still the same as it was from the very beginning, reaching out and helping everybody do more and be more And because it's our obligation to ourselves and to our families to go out there and be successful. That's our obligation because Nothing is worse, as Les Brown would say, the richest place in the world is the graveyard because you've got all these great ideas, products, and services that never went to market because people never went out there and they hesitated and couldn't make decisions. So, you know, you know, Dale Carnegie said, decision is the first step to success. And we live and die by that. We make more decisions by noon than a lot of companies I know make in 30 days. I mean, it's just rock and roll and run and gun, and you just got to lose the fear, jump in there, and just kick butt and take names later. And that's 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 how you make it happen. You just, you know, you run through walls, and if your why is big enough, you figure it out along the way. I just wanted to say one last thing. Um, you guys, um, it's, it's bringing someone along with you, too. If you go out there and you look for five people that you can bring along into this journey with you, because it's like reach one to teach one, reaching out to help someone else and bring in someone else with you to help them share in their success. Because just like it's somebody out there like you that want to help other businesses um, and, and help them succeed, there's others right with you in the same boat with you and bring them on. And let's let's just have a great party together and go on this wonderful ride and this trip together. I love it. I love it. And, and, and Mary, we are so happy uh, to have you working with us because um, you are an amazing lady, and um, there's very very few individuals we bump into along the way. And we talk to lots of people that have the work ethic, the mindset, uh, the tenacity, the personality and all the smarts to pull it all together. And so we're just honored that, you know, having you uh, involved with us, and we're just, we would just want to thank you for that. And thank you. <laughs> phenomenal. All right, well, thank you, everybody that's joined us on the line. Mary, obviously phenomenal, and I'm, I'm, I'm dazzled by your, your abilities and, and what you've accomplished with, uh, with some tenacity and some hustle. And uh, and I love it. And, and thanks, Ira and uh, and Ashley. Thanks for being on the line, taking notes, and and uh, 
posting them up. Uh, phenomenal stuff here. Everybody out there listening to this, take action. Whatever you're doing, um, whether you're joining the inner circle and uh, you're going there and taking full advantage of that, once again, it's mojovideo.org slash inner circle. Whether you're taking action on that, whether you're going out there tomorrow, hit, making your, your, your hit list of who you're going to contact, uh, who you're going to get in front of. People want to buy stuff. They're looking to buy stuff right now. Make your hit list. Get your three-foot rule mentality going, all right, and uh, just push play. That's uh, was a kind of the, uh, the breakdown of what we talked about tonight. So everybody have a, a phenomenal, phenomenal day. Let's crush it over the next week. Um, let's, let's, let's move some video. Let's move some, some apps. Let's move some, uh, some SEO. Everybody needs it. These business owners are, are, are totally in dire need of, of all your help. So let's go out there and crush it. Thanks for everybody for watching here today. And uh, did our first Google Hangout live on the air for this. And uh, pretty exciting. So we'll see you guys in the next one. Adios.